trip. Used to be to go straight up Clavering Boulevard, but now it's not so easy. Half the city's dead of the plague. The other half's fighting over what's left. City Watch still holds the bigger streets, and they've set up those wall of light checkpoints. A man walks through one of those, and he ends up burned to a crisp. Everything not controlled by the City Watch is gag territory. And there are the real odd birds living on the fringes like that Granny Rags. They say she's nuts. I don't know which is worse. Just take your pick. Let's go. It's early midnight. But easy, damn it. Keep them in the boat. Canal's got enough shit in it as it is. One, two, three, heave! Attention Dunwall citizens, this is a special announcement from our honorable Lord Regent. Don't ask me for this anything. This is the Lord Regent I'm barely getting speaking. by myself. It is with regret that I announce that my term as Lord Regent has been extended through the month of harvest. I think the little birdies are sad today. In addition, in this consistent the overseers of the Abbey of the I told you the night, dear.
I hope you like the little gift I got. See to it, dear. Up. The city's dead. We'll make it three more months. Let me out. I'm fine. <laughs> Cross the line. <laughs> I owe you, brother. I won't ask about the I can, I can feel, feel the great, great age ending. Does that mean guts? I think so. So your hands need scrubbing. You're unclean. Unclean? That's nonsense.
army of shadows in front of him. That guy down? Ain't he just a wall? Like Slackjaw? No, no, no. This is one odd bird. He sorts with more disease, does rituals and the like. Phone jumps. You sound afraid. Yeah, right, I am. Dying. Wretch, you got lucky. When you're this handsome, you don't need luck. Face like a hagfish. Pay up. Don't be sour. Say, when slap. So it goes, not to the Abbey or the office of the High Overseer, but one of the other where they train the Overseers to be real. Crazy. He just wants to know where his brother's gone. Seeks it. <laughs> Grimsley job, hitting the dumbwaiter. There is a strong drink made here. I tried it once. Distilled from river crosses, but I tasted it. Okay, here goes. The nobleman laid with the scullery maid, so loudly they made quite a riot. The nobleman's wife took the butchering knife and carved herself some peace and quiet. <laughs> oh, I get it. The wife done kind of both, right? Yeah, yeah, that's the gist. Now it's your turn. Oh, uh, let me think. Um, okay, yeah, I got one. Ready? I'm listening. There once was a sailor from Morley, who fancied a woman most sorely. He gave her his... <laughs> yeah, he was this bastard up for that big... <laughs> It's a matter of time, buddy.
I knew you wouldn't disappoint me. Now I can stroll along the waterfront in peace. And don't think I've forgotten your little gift. Go on upstairs, dear one. That will never wash. Never, never, never. Chew. Be careful, Corvo. They call her Granny Rags. You wouldn't recognize her real name, or even the name of her family, but an emperor begged for her hand once, and rich young men fought each other for her favor. I watched her consider them all, measure their worth, and find them wanting. Then, she made a different choice. You're on your way to face the High Overseer, the leader of a great cult dedicated to loathing me. What will you do, I wonder? She wouldn't put the crackers on the right side of her. is a whaler's gaff hand. Fifty years old, at least. This guy fought for the Emperor. Forget his old ass. <laughs> <laughs> The doom of Hadesia has come to the city. Huh? Fall down already! The second day is when the skin really starts to come all the way off. <sighs> all right, I won't be of any help here, so I'll make my own way back to the Hound Pit. Fussy Samuel. I was just reading in the archive about the Heretic Brand. It sounds painful. Have you ever seen the ritual? I've never seen the Heretic's Brand. No, it's a rare occurrence. But I did spy the face of one so branded. A former member of our order, of course. Out on a retreat, we passed through a fishing town and saw him begging. What were his crimes? Who can say? The brand is reserved for an overseer, or even the high overseer himself, who violates our codes and must be cast out permanently. There are seven strictures, and you never need worry. I will. Did you get caught in the lockdown last night? Six hours. Search the place top to bottom. And nothing to eat but the swill we hand out free. Of course we didn't find anything. Did I ever tell you, one time one of the second floor shutters got stuck open, and I thought I could slip out? I couldn't find a way down. And by the time I... Oh,
beginning. It was Martin's plot to break him out of Coldridge Prison. That's clear enough. But why Corvo? The one man feared throughout the Empire. He's as bloody-minded as they say. Left a trail of bodies. And the way he dodged the axe, we can't rule out black magic. He had help, yes, but how far does it go? The trail goes to Martin, but Martin knows everyone. Everywhere. having trouble holding the side streets. Like children playing games, that's all it is. Good, good. And you... Callista. I'm very concerned about it. She'll be found. My men are searching district by district. The poor girl. Callista's a resourceful one. Probably found a safe place to hold up in all this chaos. If my overseers hear any word, I'll come straight to you. So, time for drinks. I hope you won't refuse. It'll make this business pass all the quicker. So, Locked. One of the servants must have been in here. Let me see. It seems I have the wrong one. Not that one. No. Ah, here we are. Now if you'll join me. Men will come get you when we're finished. Keep each other entertained in the meantime. I don't understand how this got so unpleasant. Oh, I agree, I agree. A whore dies and suddenly this. Will you have wine? It's a Tivian Red. Thank you. What a... Who's been in here? I owe you an apology, Captain. This is hardly the hospitality I planned for you. Well, City get any worse? Indeed, I believe so. My sister! She's not a witch! I know her! Out of the way! You expect preferential treatment just because you are her brother? She will burn. You appeared as if from nowhere. 
We would both be dead if not for you. We are forever in your debt. I cannot thank you enough. I must get my sister to safety. But first, I may know of a way to thank you. There's a safe in the bunkhouse. The combination is two, zero, three. Take what you want, and good luck. trying to conceal it from us, your brothers in the Order. Was that your intent? To spread the malady to us? No, friend. I, I tell you, I am well. <laughs> as fit as ever, put down your weapons. Just think for a moment before you... He was sick. Very, very sick. That much I'm sure of. Now to find some way to dispose of the body without spreading his illness. I hear it. Campbell lived a pretty posh life. Maybe it's not my place to say, but men of the faith shouldn't live like barons. Are you ready to go? Okay, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> 